Well, good morning. And welcome back to Nacho Stuff. I hope everybody had a wonderful holiday weekend, or those uh, at least in the States. For all you other people, hope you had a great weekend. And sorry you missed me on Monday, but that's what happens during holiday weekend. We got some junks in the back from some cleaning we did over the weekend. We might do a non-Ferris Friday on not Friday. I don't know, we'll have to see Ugh. how the day goes and go from there. There's like a ton of pool pumps and chairs and all kinds of stuff getting tore apart this weekend. So we're gonna get out and about and hopefully tear it up today. These are nice heavy chairs. They're not aluminum, but they're nice and chunky. So I'll take them. Oosh. So let's get out after it. See what we can find. It's a big punky, chunky pile. Or chunky pile. Easy for you to say, man. But it's the IKEA. The infamous IKEA hunk of metal. <laughs> Rest of that's wood. But we'll take that gladly. Well, I watched Cav yesterday. He cleaned up pretty well. He's gonna have to go to the yard this morning. But I was really surprised at the amount of stuff he found, but there's a bunch out here again this morning, which is nice to see. All right, it just keeps coming. Can we do two loads today? Woo, shoes. No, these are, these are well-worn shoes. That is concrete. This is a dishwasher. Ooh, an old one at that. Feels like it's got water. <clears throat> no, it doesn't. It's water, but just a little bit. Little baby twofer. A couple of chairs. Looks like a couple of tiki's maybe. Yeah, a couple of tiki's. Don't run me over! Get all the way in there. Come on, brah. Thank you. This is an interesting little stop. What do we got in here? Oh, these are shoe formers for all my shoes. It's like a, it's like a game. Can you get the belt off of the license plate? How many tries will it take him? Come on. Dun, 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 dun. Hoo -yah. Hoo -yah. Yes, he does it. Score! They're looking out their windows right now. Going, what the hell is that guy doing? What is that crazy man doing out there, mom? This is probably aluminum, right? Yeah, it's aluminum. You're gonna come up here. Shink. For my, for my shoes. I'll take a little extra wire. I think I found some Air Jordans. Shink. Ooh, they are worn Air Jordans, aren't they? Are super worn. What else we got here? Is that table metal? Garbage cans metal. Zink. We don't want you, we don't want you. What we got going here, folks? New metal. Oh, yes, you are. You can come up front here. Blink. Let's mosey on. Look at this little set here. <laughs> it's a rebar table. Put you guys up front here. Little bird cage. That's a fancy little bird cage. Go ahead, tell me guys. You should take that. That would sell for one million dollars. I don't know. Let's let's consider it. It is kind of a cute decoration, is it not? 
little chair is kind of cute too. We'll keep you guys together. We don't want any plants though. Let's go. It's a trap, man. It's a trap. I'm trying to pull you in with the shoes. No, those are old shoes. I don't want those. I really don't want this either if we can get it all off. Come on. You can come off. We really don't want you. Come on. Don't be super knotted any place, guys. Oosh. There we go. You can stay with your shoes. I know. GCR is going, Matt, you should keep that. That chair is super popular. Not keeping it. I think these match a set I already have. I think they do. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. It's very similar, though. People would buy these though. We're gonna give them a try, guys. Morning. Yeah, metal chairs, I will. Sure. Thank you. Yeah, that happens a lot. <laughs> hey, have a great day. Ugh. Another chair bites the dust. Let's go. Ooh, wow, it's a triple umbrella. <laughs> That's an umbrella, man. Oh, yeah. Most definitely steel to hold triple umbrella. I guess we're gathering a bunch of chairs today. But this is our first random chair of the day. All the other ones have been patio variety. Um, let's turn you like such and put you like this. Come on, get down. Right there. Right there. Live right there. Patio furniture party of five. Oh, look at that. That's bottle cap top. Report to my trailer. That's pretty cool. It's a shame to throw that away. Although they probably should have <clears throat> put, uh, what's it called? Uh, epoxy see on the top so it didn't rust although it looked kind of cool if they put epoxy it would still have all the all the bottles and stuff we're just putting them back here for now let's see if they stack. let's see if they stack first man kind of they're not true stackers but they kind of stack Mostly ceramic. Not true stackers, but definitely going to reduce. Reduce real estate. Are these going to come out? Oh, they do come out. I think I'm actually, actually I should probably take these shit. Mostly, they're mostly metal. See their bottle tops. This is probably aluminum then, huh? Yeah, probably is. Uh oh, we lost a couple of caps. It's weird that they have like all different kind of beers on here. Most beer drinkers are probably Committed to their beers. Or at least that's what I found. They must be partying with friends. Come on, Mr. Aluminum. Ah, 
right, let's go. Back on some staples. The bed rail. Oh, you can get by there, brother. I know you can. I know you can do it. Oh, you're not gonna go for it though, huh? All right, I'll get out of your way then. I ain't kidding, man. Chair day galore. There's another one of them gaming chairs. I don't know if you guys <clears throat> were here last week when I was talking about it, but the kids are out of school. Today's the first official day of summer, since yesterday was actually a holiday. We don't count that one, I guess. So, today's the first official day of summer break. All the game chairs are going for the new game chairs to come in for them to rot their brains for the next two months. Just a guess. He's just a baby, but we're going to take it. Ooh, he's a little beat up too. He's a bit bigger than I thought he was. Oh, come on, drapes. Come off of there. I don't want the drapes. I just want to pull. Come on. Get off. This is worse than the belt. Oh, you stinkers. Get off of there. All right, what kind of TV have we got here? Oh, that's the plug I needed too. Sweet. Now I can test the other TV that I've got. Almost missed this one. It's all tucked up in here and it's probably aluminum too. One of these clothing dry racks. Uh, come on, right there's where you're gonna live. Enjoy yourself. All right, our first chunky piece of scrap. All right, wheels on that side. Morning. We've got a flat wheel, I think. Nope, you go back a little bit more. I'm not ready for you to go there yet. You gotta come past the tire, bro. There you go, right there. Booyah! A lot of people ask why I put the grills in upside down. I do that because the weight is on the top. This makes it less likely to fall over. Plus, that's the way I can flip it in. It's just physics. I've been traveling around my way. <laughs> hey guys, we have made it to the yard. You'll notice we've got a couple of things on here that we didn't have before. I've been having issues with my camera, but we did end up getting a refrigerator and a grill at one spot, so I had to shift everything up. So it was uh, not fun. Well, what you going to do? And this, you can see this yard still just a disaster. So uh, I know you guys were grabbing at me for missing a cord last week on the refrigerator. I did. So I'm going to get the cord off of this guy. Or maybe I already. No, I didn't. Like, well, maybe I already did. It's right here. I'm tired today, man. That uh, long weekend of work. <laughs> I'm tired. Oh, I still got a strap in here. It's still strapped on. Son of a biscuit. I thought I had all my straps off. Get out of my way. I missed this guy. He was tucked under that chair. Got Mikey here at the yard unloading. He's doing load number two of the day. Him and Packer Scrapper are just beasts. You know, Kev, Mr. Uh, Part-Timer says, I'm gonna just, I, I, I'm too old to run more than one trip a day. Guy runs like four trips a day and then uh, works on the weekends and holidays and everything else. Not me. That's too old for that. Just thought 
these were aluminum. This one's too heavy for aluminum now. Yeah, you're not aluminum. You are though. I already took the lid off that grill. We gotta get the other bottom part off of that grill that we're gonna see. Go get our pipe wrench and get the motor off that dishwasher. I can't believe they got, haven't got rid of that fan yet. Oh my. Pipe wrench I think is up here. I don't think you're gonna be able to get by, bro. This yard's just too sloppy. So one of my um, pieces of my exercise equipment's over there and the other one's over here. I want to say this didn't get filmed either. They, uh, because the other half of that, remember that ladder I found that didn't have a top to it? Here's a top to it. I turned in the other half, like, I don't know, what was that, a month ago? And there's the other half that I was missing. This is. GCR share. I don't know. We'll set it out here for a minute. I'll think about that a little bit more. It's actually a pretty nice shape. For that style chair at least. That trailer's full of wire. <laughs> Mikey, that trailer's full of wire. <laughs> oh. You want to go get it? <laughs> I'll hoist you up. <laughs> Oh. oh, it's crazy how much meat on the bone there is out here. See, we don't have that big of a load today, so it ends up not being too much of an issue. But we were like full is a problem. It didn't help starting off with uh, those uh, three big bins of stuff either. Come on. Release. Nope, wrong one. Uh, release button. Where are you? This one? Yeah. Hoo yeah. Ha. Stupid thing. I forgot to check this one, didn't I? Let's check this one before we leave. Oh, that rebar. Oosh.
Yeah, these are cute. I don't have room in my house for cute. That's stainless. That door might be stainless too, maybe. I think that's where that first one came from. Over there, just talking to his peoples. Me, I'm just over here huffing and puffing. <sighs> <Ooh. laughs> uh. This chair was like almost all cast aluminum. That's the non ferrous stuff. This stuff goes. she wrote I'm going to uh, load this guy back up and uh, decide on that come on GCR give me some uh, wisdom what's he got in there that looks nice I'll see you guys over at Jeffy's let's do some NFJ shink shink Oh, I forgot to check the TV. <laughs> Where did you get that at? Uh, my girlfriend bought it and, and a t-shirt that says dad joke loading. <laughs> so, uh, we'll always have a dad joke. <laughs> Sweet. I keep forgetting my reel. This? Yeah, yeah why? Did you want it? It's a pretty good shape, so yeah. I, I felt, I felt. Online. Remember that ladder I turned in like a month ago? Yeah. There's the other half. I cleaned some stuff up, I slept, I played with the kids, I went in my cold pool, I went in my cold pool, I cut the one half, I cut the, I cut one of the rings off, I just didn't have the, didn't have the strength to pull it through. How about ambition? Yeah, or that. <laughs> ambition. Uh, this should be clean, yeah, I think so, all right. Come on, baby. Yeah, yeah baby, that's clean. Over there. This had, uh, all the panels here were covered in bottle caps. Oh, panels? Yeah. You good over here? Yeah. Man, you got crap all over the place. That's what I Ugh. You want this over there too?
I gotta think of the one that I had. I had one this morning and I totally lost it. All right. Um, hang on. I gotta think of what it was. Ugh. You ready for all these motors? Oh, I got one more. I can't believe I forgot that TV. I can't believe I forgot that TV. That's all that matters. I went to the pawn shop again today. 85 bucks. Hey, Jeff. I told my wife she needs to embrace her mistakes so just she came over and gave me a hug very carefully single handedly, single -handedly. <laughs> uh, what's that crane action you're pretty light out here though you're pretty light. There's not that much stuff over here. How can I get my transmission to be longer? I, I, it says. Alrighty, guys, we're waiting paid. You know, I was thinking about what I was going to do today. I said, you know, we were out there running around. It's only 11 o'clock. So normally we would go back out and try to make things happen. I ain't doing that. <laughs> I'm tired, man. I just, I just. Like I told Jeff, I don't have the strength. And he said, you mean ambition? <laughs> yeah, that's probably the word I was looking for. I just, I, I just don't feel it. I could probably go back out, but I'll be competing hardcore with the garbage guys and everybody else. So I'm gonna call Kevin and let him know where I've run, where I haven't, so he can go pick up extra morsels if he wants to. I'm pretty happy with where we're at today. Um, so let's jump into the receipt and then we'll talk about what else we did. Tim, 1,100 pounds. So we hit the mark we're looking for. Seven cents a pound for 77 bucks. Irony Light was uh, that clothing rack, the grill top and bottom, I think, actually. Um, and whatever else was dirty aluminum. 62 pounds, 28 cents a pound for 1736. Clean aluminum was the table, 17 pounds, 40 cents a pound for 680. Stainless steel clean were the, the different pieces, the two doors and some trim to the grill. 12 pounds, 40 cents a pound for 480 electric motors. I found a motor where I found that, la oh, that ladder was part of the dirty aluminum too. Where that, that ladder, um, where my camera was being goofy. There was, a, I think it was an alternator actually. Uh, anyhow, it was electric motor plus the two off the dishwasher, 21 pounds, 15 cents a pound for 315. I know I didn't take the compressor off the refrigerator, I just didn't feel like it, so I left it. Um, it probably would have been a couple of bucks. So our grand total on uh, our, our scrap was 109.11. So we hit the mark we're trying to hit. It's nice to go well above that, and we did, because like I told Jeffy, um, I swung by the pawn shop again. I, I, like I said, I was uh, trying to straighten up and clean up some stuff in the house this weekend. Um, and I found a whole bunch of stuff that I had set aside, tools, and I've got duplicates of so many things. So I took a chop saw, uh, or actually said, this is what she bought. A chop saw, two circular saws, uh, and uh, a small TV um, she bought for 85 bucks. So I was pretty happy with that. Um, and I've still got one more TV at the house that's going to go in eventually. I think it's a 70 incher um, that works. So uh, the one that I have in the back uh, is for my TV guy that I didn't swing by today because I never went by his neighborhood. I'll have to catch him on Friday, I guess. So uh, I'm happy with the day, man. Between the uh, pawn shop and the street, 185, we'll take that all day long. So. Uh, I was good at considering bringing up non-ferrous because I do have a lot cleaned up at the house, but I don't have it all cleaned up. So I just might wait till the, and do a true non-ferrous Friday once I've got the uh, rest of it cleaned up. Maybe I'll do that this afternoon uh, if I uh, get the urge. But my son's got uh, a, a scrimmage this, this evening and it's like, 
oodles away compared to where we normally go to. And it's against the traffic, so it's not going to be fun driving to that. So I got to go home and uh, make sure that he's got all his stuff pulled together uh, for that. And then we'll see what the afternoon brings. I hope you enjoyed today's run. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up. I apologize for any camera issues we had today. Again, we had no pickers. We just had the scrap, but that's what we're doing. We're scrapping and hoping for pickers. Uh, good thing we're not picking, hoping for scrap. <laughs> Anywho's, it's not show stuff, but that doesn't mean you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy, and I'll catch y'all then.